Mold. I don't know. Salt in the air. Don't you guys have salt in the rain here? Something like that. The fog, the saltiness. Okay, so I'm going to tell my stories over again. Uh, the first one is... <laughs> that's funny, isn't it? Uh, I'm going to... Okay, so... Let's go with Tanya. Okay, this bitch was crazy, man. I dated her about 10 years ago. Um, she did the 80s thing. I guess she was stuck in the 80s. She put a whole bunch of hairspray in there and then do the burn it thing and be smoking <laughs> like that. And then she'd uh, do this thing. I don't know. She'd rat it out. It was weird. I was like, it looked like it hurt a little bit. Uh, anyway, so she had completely like infused her hair with hairspray over the, over the years of use. And one night we were in there smoking weed. And uh, sure enough, there's a group of people sitting here watching. And sure enough, I just had thought it. I was like, I am psychic. I know it's fixing to happen. I was like, wouldn't it be funny if a piece of her hair fell over right, right there on the lighter? And sure enough, five seconds later, what happened? But <laughs> advanced mullet right there. A little sprig in the front. Pleasure in the back. <laughs> okay, insert laughter here. No? All right, that didn't work out. What was my other one? Oh, yeah. This guy over here, he mentioned the other thing I was talking about. Um, I do weddings and birthdays and stuff like that. And so I'm filming away at this wedding in Texas. And it's in Texas, of course. Anyway, I'm watching them. And I'm like, all right, nice little wedding. We get the shot over here. And then, boom, they, they kind of look alike. I'm like, I'm noticing this. And, you know, you could just have anybody walk you down the aisle, I suppose, so. Anyway, it comes down here and does the wedding. We're at the reception, and you know those little formal dances, like the mother-son dance, all that stuff like that? Well, they had a brother-sister dance, all right? So, George Bush in it, over here. And, uh, boom, I was, I, something hit my head. I just thought, okay, I gotta make a joke about this, because I didn't think it was real. I thought they were joking with me. And uh, I go, all right, now we're going to have the, you know, the brother and sister come up here. And I started saying something. This family's close. And the dad comes straight up to the DJ booth. He looks like Yosemite Sam. He's about like this, got the mustache, red beard. He's pretty, it was funny. A little tuxedo. It was cute. It's all cute. It's short and stuff. Yosemite Sam. But anyway, he said, we have a close family. And I was like, all right, I'm in Texas. <laughs> all right, I'm in Texas. Texas. <laughs> okay, anyway. Yeah, that was for the guy back there playing the pool. He left. Do you so, add on a shout out to your friend on this? Yeah, you know what? This this comedy is dedicated to uh, Dustin Tapp. He's got a porn name. Isn't that weird? I'm all, that's when I that's how I kind of became friends with him. I'm like Dustin Tapp. What the Dustin Tapp? Dustin Tapp. No, anyway, he won't eat these chips. Um, you guys ever had waffle and chicken chips? Okay, I won't go back into this because I just told the story. I think all of you. They're <laughs> awesome. They're the best. So, I'm the best. I'm the best, and the professionals told me that. I meant the chips, but that's... Oh, the but chips? Yeah, but yeah, yeah the too, chips yeah. are the best. Um, I thought I was getting a compliment. Hey, you guys... You are, too. It's... Am I? Yeah, double Okay, I'm waffles double and chicken, up. baby. So what is up? <laughs> anyway. Okay, let me do a trivia. Crayola crayons. Okay, variations of red currently available in the Crayola color lineup. The most shades of any color. Which color has the most shades, according to Crayola, right now? Just look at it. You can see that little pack, the big one that you always wanted but you couldn't get. And it had the little sharpener, you know. I always had it like a knife and stick mine out there. I'm going to say red. Yeah. Okay. Red. Red. It's 23 variations of red. There's 23 shades of red according to Crayola. Watch her. She's going to get all sugared up right there. So anyway, now I'm feeling it. It's five minutes. The last five minutes of math class. You guys remember, you guys remember class? You remember so school? Weird. Remember sitting there for the last five minutes? You're like, oh. you got lunch next. You're like, oh. you know what I'm saying? Get away. But anyway, oh, oh, oh. I got one, dude. My wife has the devil voice, okay? She'll be sitting here and she'll be, you know, talking along to me, and she's like really famous for burping. I mean, just in the most appropriate places, and it's like beautiful, like opera. Anyway, so <laughs> this is drawing me today. She says, she says, I love you, like that today. She just let out a burp right in the middle. She doesn't like say, excuse me. 
She just continues talking, says the words. So she burped, I love you today. And I was like, thank you, Satan. That's, that's awesome. I said, I'm glad you're so fine. You know, she's a good looking woman. If you can objectify anybody, it's your wife. So go for it. Right. Right? Right. What, man? You want me to objectify your wife? Dude, when I first saw you, I thought you were a guy. I was like, what a cute little gay couple. <laughs> and then, no, okay, that's a joke I'm working on for next time. So. Oh, that's good. That's, that's You're good. right, right? See, you can yeah. see where that'd be funny, right? Hair because short. look at his hair. Yeah. <laughs> Gay couple. This old joke. Okay. All right. Come on, it's funny. I know I'm over here talking to these guys, and everybody's laughing. I'm sorry. But anyway, what? Or when are we doing this next? Do we have any announcements? Yeah, well, I will go up when do, you're, do, yeah, when you're finished. I'll announce that I'm done, so that could be your cue to exit the booth there. Yeah, I feel right. like a fried chicken. I'm on.